in just 10 minutes i will be showing you exactly how i created this amazing masterpiece with three smartphone apps which are adobe lightroom pixel app and pixart stick around and follow me carefully while i take you on this short journey i will see you in the video all right so once again you are welcome to this tutorial okay if you are new to this channel you know what to do do where to smash the subscribe button also hit the like button so that this video can reach more people and turn on your notification bell so that youtube can notify you whenever i drop any new video okay first thing i'm going to do is to um change the size okay so the chat the size i use sorry the size i use is 1080 and for the height i use 1350 okay 1080 by 1350 now i would like you to pay careful attention because you need to get this in just 10 minutes all right now there are the resources i use for this i use basically these um major resources okay this um just three resources okay and all these resources are going to be available for you in the link below okay so just check the description box you are going to see the link to a telegram community where you can get all these resources and even more for free now i'm going to add everything and i'm just going to start work immediately okay so there's one resources i missed there's one um one resource i need very important that i missed okay so this is it. this is the background i'm going to be using and you're also going to get this in that same telegram community okay so now i'm going to start work just follow me carefully ensure that you follow me carefully so first i'm going to increase the size um when you increase the quality like um, when you increase that image like that or a shape whatever the quality tend to reduce since you are using pixel app okay so the next thing i'm going to do now is to adjust the ear a bit and just increase it okay yes um let me leave it at 15 or 10 10 is okay 10 is cool by me then i'm also going to increase the contrast to five okay guys we have less than eight minutes now okay <laughs> yeah so i'm going to lock this and this is what we got so i'm going to just um on hide this and this is the image i'm using so um this is an amazing lady so i'm just going to place this here i'm going to copy it just like i said the quality has reduced which i don't want sorry okay delete all right so this is the image i'm going to reduce the size and um reduce the size also so i'm going to position it to the center i'll lock it the next thing i'm going to do now is to work on my background so i'm going to just copy this this particular um linkedin blood link linkedin icon i'm going to move this to the back then i'm going to also um reduce the opacity next okay so i'm going to reduce the opacity like you can see on my screen right now so i feel i should lock okay it's locked already so i'm just going to do something like this today. then i'm going to copy it i'm going to rotate it but this time around i'm just going to tap on this okay so that's the opposite all right so this is what i've got so far then i'm going to move this to the back again all right guys this is what we've got so i'm going to lock the two images okay then i'm going to copy this particular um yeah this particular icon i'm going to move it to the back too then i'm going to reduce the size a bit yes and i'm going to reduce the opacity all right guys this is what i've got now okay so i'm going to position this to the center i'm going to move this to the back a bit and i'm going to lock it so now tap on this uh, image this um lady image click on shadow enable shadow so I'm just, I just want to adjust and add a little shadow to it to make it look realistic. Then I'm going to click on plus. I'm going to reduce the opacity. Yes, let me do that again. Okay. Yeah, so we have about 10 minutes more left. Okay, we have about 10 minutes. Um, Sorry, we have about 5 minutes more. <laughs> oh, come on. Okay, so I'm going to just lock this. It's locked already. Then the next thing I'm going to do now is to click on shape. Okay click on shape and then i want to create a gradient so click on gradient click on plus tap on this in okay i'm going to adjust the color again okay so i feel like this is great now okay so this is it i'm just going to move this here i'm going to move this here yes okay 
so this is cool now this is cool i'm going to reduce the opacity a bit okay i, I don't just want that sharp part of our cloth to be obvious so yeah i'm going to lock this and then the next thing i'm going to do now is to click on the um, click on text increase the size increase the size change the color to white okay change the color to pure white then the text is 10k okay 10k then the font i use for this is sql okay i use sql this is a sql 100 black it's going to be available for you also in the telegram community okay it's going to be available for you there so just ensure that you are in the community all right so this is it um because if you look at it some part of this letter has um cut away so just come to paddling increase the paddling then increase this to to 1818 okay so 1818 is a great number so this is what i've got i'm going to move this down a bit then the next thing i'm going to do now is to is to create a shape okay so basically i'm going to come on you can lock this so that they're not going to disturb your work so i'm just going to lock this okay come on create a shape okay then move this down move this down okay then bring it here all right i'm going to change the color to i'm just going to pick a color from here mark it okay and um no i'm not okay with that so i'm just going to adjust yes this is cool then i'm going to increase the radius to five just five then i'm going to move this here and position it here i'm going to also ensure that this is well positioned then i'm going to reduce the size okay then ensure that it's still well positioned and i feel like i'm missing something here okay so yeah this is it ensure that it's still well positioned all right so the next thing i'm going to do now is to click on shape right click on shape and uh, move it here change the color to this okay we are still working with this color move it here move it here okay so ensure that it's well placed right ensure that it's well placed okay so yeah this is it so place it here too then next thing i'm going to do now i'm going to copy this copy this okay then let the only letter be z um o okay then move this on here all right move this on here and click on mask okay click on mask then click on then adjust the mask a bit okay adjust the marks a bit then look at it like you can see i've created that you can see what i just created so i'm going to adjust the o so that it's going to blend well so it's going to blend well yes it has blended well okay so you can just take out your time take out your time um take your time rather to adjust it so i'm going to lock this then i'm going to adjust this again look at it i'm going to just take out the time and um be careful so that you can achieve something perfect or at least close to perfect all right so you can see what i'm doing now okay so the next thing i'm going to do is to click on um text okay so the next thing i'm going to do now is just to come here then click on change the color to white change the color to white and then change to followers okay followers all right then click on fonts the font i use for this is called codec okay codec look at it codec code extra board so that's what i use for this i'm just going to reduce the spacing okay like you can see i'm just going to reduce oh come on no that that was too much so i'm going to reduce the size now yeah i'm going to reduce the size so that i can fit into the shape very well and if i need to adjust the shape maybe it's not big enough i can adjust it i can easily adjust it okay i can easily adjust it then um, ensure that it's still well placed okay.